2020. Dear Diary, I was so chuffed the other day, right, because my pal sent me a video message. Now, I haven't spoken to this pal for a long time because she ditched me and the rest of her pals and ran off to become a material girl in America. Anyway, it was a lovely surprise. It was to get this wee video message for her at this dark time. Obviously, she just wanted to bring some joy and hope into my life, you know? Or so I thought. Then I realised that it was actually just full of coded insults. You know, that I wasn't sure whether to share this with anybody else, but I know I can confide in you. So I can confirm to you that the said aforementioned ex-friend of mine is dot 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 Mad Donna from Castlemark. She sent me this video, right? She was in the bath. No, sorry. Extra information. She was in the scuddy in the bath. And she was grasping onto the wee turning taps, you know, as if she was trying to steer it somewhere. The bath. Anywho, she was banging on about this coronavirus, right? Seeing how it doesn't discriminate and how we're all the same. All of us. Us and Mad Donna, right? The same. I've got a, the same Donna hen. The same. Honestly, I'm literally rationing cucumber, right? My husband tried to make a sandwich earlier and he chopped the end of the cucumber. You know, the start bit chopped it off. He left about an inch of edible vegetable attached to it. He was going to bin it. I says, you bin that, I'll bin you, pal. What are you thinking? How could you be so irresponsible? We can run out of that. I mean, I had to scrape together a tenner for a wee cheap bunch of flowers from my mammy for Mother's Day. I had to hand them to her, two metres apart, hanging off the end of a stick in a wee Aldi bag. No mad Donna for castle milk, no. She's ripping off the heat of her flowers, plucking out all the wee petals and scattering them in her bath, which by the way, had no bubbles in it. No bubbles in a bath. I mean, not a bottle of meaty in sight. I mean, if that doesn't make her different for us mere mortals, then I genuinely don't know what does. She's saying we're on the same boat. We're all in the same boat. We're all in the same... No, we're no. We're no, Donna Hen. We're no in the same boat. We are absolutely not in the same boat. Right? You're in a yacht. No, I'm saying I, I might as well be cutting about in a canoe or what's a pedal and not even a nice swan pedal, you know, because all the powers have had to shut them down and up. Mad Donna, eh? She can keep steering her wee bath wherever it is she's trying to go. Because I tell you, so now, she's definitely, absolutely, categorically off my Christmas card list this year. Just like wee Kylie. Don't get me started on her. Wee Kylie. Forgotten. Aye. She left the girl group that we formed in 1999, before the millennium, right? To go solo. Ha! <laughs> solo, Kylie. What was she hit? Do you know what she did? She went to another one hit, didn't she? On account of the gold hot pants she wore in her music video. She claimed she bought them for 50p at a charity shop. But everybody, everybody in the suicide of Glasgow that knows anything about anything, right? Knows that she swiped the gold hot pants off me. They were my gold hot pants, right? And everybody knows I found them in the bargain bucket at the Sally Army shop in Shawlands Arcade, 1999. All right, hashtag, I'm just saying. Here, do you know they've shut all the McDonald's and the drive throughs and all? This is getting really serious now, pals. To take care of each other and wash your hands. All right. <laughs>